while big names like Final Fantasy have gotten all the glory, these gems have been hidden away. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 forgotten JRPGs. It will surely lead you to victory. For this list, we're counting down the JRPGs that were considered pretty good when they were released, but never given the chance to shine. Number 10, Eternal Sonata. Eternal Sonata already begins on a unique note, pun intended, with its inclusion of classical music into its story. And then there are the flowers. They seem to blossom almost everywhere in the town. Polish composer Frédéric Chopin is on his deathbed, and during his final moments, he has a dream, which becomes the game. It's said that people can have the most peaceful dreams just before they pass on. Pretty much everything in this game is based off Chopin's work, as well as classical music as a whole. Character and town names are based off musical terms, and each part of the story is based on one of Chopin's compositions. Everything around us is all a part of my dream. Even you are just a product of my imagination. Number 9. Odin Sphere. I will face him. Princess, you shall not. In this artistic action RPG, the protagonists must stop the demon lord Odin from finding the crystallization cauldron and thereby preventing Armageddon. If we can obtain that cauldron and fabricate our own jewels, Ragnarok will have no more enemies. What makes Odin Sphere different is that the story is told through the perspective of five different characters, each with their own chapter. You may be one of our nation's heroes. But I hear that you act as you wish because my father does nothing to stop you. Each character has their own stories and motivations, which intertwine with each other, setting certain conflicts in motion. Characters range from the daughter of the demon lord to a prince who's been turned into a rabbit-like creature and banished to the underworld. Even if you leave here, you will enter the demon lord's domain. Number 8. Alundra <laughs> Sharing its name with its main protagonist, Alundra is about a boy who has the power to enter people's dreams and must rescue the inhabitants of Inoa from a dark curse. As well as its action RPG elements, Alundra emphasizes puzzle solving and exploration, with the puzzles becoming unsolvable unless you have cleared certain parts of the game. Despite all the praise for its dark story and challenging but rewarding puzzles, it was quickly overshadowed by others of its kind, but it still did gain its own sequel. Number 7. Lunar – Silver Star Story Complete This is a remake of the Sega CD's Lunar – The Silver Star. It follows the adventures of Alex, who must claim the title of Dragon Master. He does this by passing trials laid before him by ancient dragons, all while trying to stop an evil sorcerer from controlling the world. Perhaps you should demonstrate the power that gives you such confidence. The story was adapted from its original game, but with improved graphics, fluid animation, and additions to the game's cast and story. If we hurry, we may be able to sneak in without waking the dragon. Then we can get a fantastically huge diamond from its lair worth thousands and thousands of silver. Even though this game has been seen several times on different systems, it still has only managed to achieve a cult following. I believe each of us is entrusted with a future to realize, and this is not our future. Number 6. Wild Arms Although this game might feature your standard Save the World plotline, it's centered in a unique landscape which is based off the Wild West. You play as Rudy, who is able to use an ancient weapon known as Arms, which resembles a firearm. Keeping with the western motif, you get to explore huge wastelands and do it all to a western-inspired soundtrack. This game was not only one of the very few RPGs to be based off the Wild West, but also one of the very best titles on the PlayStation. Number 5. Legend of Dragoon yes. Double flash. Released late in the PlayStation's life cycle, Legend of Dragoon was written off as just another average JRPG. <laughs> However, what makes this game unique is the additions combat system, which has you entering button combinations as you attack, allowing you to deal extra damage. <laughs> another new mechanic is the ability to transform into Dragoons, which grant the character new abilities as well as some cool armor. Nowadays, Legend of Dragoon has gained a sizable fan base who have been begging for a sequel for quite some time. 
Number four, Dark Cloud 2. Also known as Dark Chronicle in Japan, you take control of Max and Monica, who are from the present and future respectively, and must travel back in time to stop Emperor Griffin from destroying the future. <laughs> I got them! This is what I wanted! Unlike most RPGs, your character does not level up, but it's their weapon instead which gains experience from defeating enemies. There's also a city-building aspect to the game, where you can create and rearrange buildings for villagers to live in, provided you have the items. Ah, but the people in this town really are living the sweet life, eh? Huh? Number three, Shadow Hearts, Covenant. Here it comes. Taking place in the midst of World War I, you play as German Lieutenant Karen Koenig and Yuri, a man capable of turning into different types of demons. Shadow Hearts features the Judgment Ring, which is a roulette that dictates what actions the player will take and how they will affect the outcome of the battle. You are able to customize these rings with different abilities and items. It's not often that you see a war game that's not an FPS in World War II, let alone one that has you playing as a German soldier. Number 2. Fantasy Star the Fantasy Star series has garnered its fair share of attention. However, most people seem to be oblivious to the game that started it. Fantasy Star on the Sega Master System was one of the pioneers of the original JRPGs, featuring turn-based combat, overworld maps with towns and dungeons to explore, as well as random enemy encounters. From here, it has spawned a few sequels and even the Fantasy Star Online series, ensuring that it wasn't totally forgotten. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Number 1. Skies of Arcadia In our list of the top 10 overlooked games of all time, we mentioned that Skies of Arcadia has never gotten the attention it deserves, and we stand by that. Playing as an air pirate, you must stop the resurrection of ancient weapons with the power to destroy the world. Skies of Arcadia features gorgeous scenery, an amazing soundtrack, colorful characters, and of course, airship battles. Despite amazing reviews and even a GameCube re-release, this game has been severely underappreciated. Chances are that due to the nature of this list, it's likely that we forgot a few of your favorite JRPGs. So, let us know which JRPG you think gets no love these days. And for more top 10s that aren't as easily forgotten, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com. Is it over already?